The game revolves around earning naughty points and a scoring system that is deep but easy to understand. There are over 250 different ways of being naughty on the island. Basically, you earn points for any naughty things you do and any naughtiness that the other bears witness. Any actions, even basic ones like disabling a car or smashing a window, will start building your multiplier and this will boost your points for as long as you keep your naughtiness going. There are dozens of weapons to use, from pistols and machetes to more unusual weapons like umbrellas and frozen legs of lamb. There are also mundane everyday objects like refrigerators, cars and barbecue grills to experiment with, each one having its own hilarious finishing move. Killing them is a lot of fun, but there are a ton of other ways to get your revenge. Keep them alive and they'll give you way more points as they witness all the chaos you're causing. Part of the fun of the game is discovering all the different actions that you can do, each one viciously naughty in its own special way. You can play the game any way you want to and do what you think is best for your current situation to get the most points out of a level. Keep in mind though, that taking risks, being creative and changing your tactics often will reward you with a lot more naughty points. Another great example of creative scoring is the traps that you can place anywhere that you think the other bears might go. When one of them runs into one, you're free to choose which strategy to use. Scare him out of there, break his neck and risk a rescue, or just leave him suffering for the others to witness. Each episode features unique bear types like ninjas or cops which act and react differently to your actions. Even more excitingly, each bear found on Perfection Island has their own unique personality traits, skills and preferences that make them behave differently. Some are courageous and may go and arm themselves to hunt you down, or they may go and hide or escape the island by boat. Others are more intelligent and may call the police or form groups and order the other bears around. It's important to understand each of the bear's personality to maximize your points. Killing a bear is extremely naughty, but the game is much more than just about killing. By keeping bears alive, you take more risk, but it can reap great rewards. When the other bears witness too much of your naughtiness, they can't take it anymore and they get driven insane. At this point, if you corner them and boo them one last time, they will use whatever they have in their hand to execute themselves. This really is one of the naughtiest things you can do and it'll help you build that huge score you need to beat your friends on the leaderboards. As you play, you are constantly pushed to beat your friends' high scores that are shown in game. There are also more than 50 different ranks to unlock, from Naughty Cub to the King of Naughtiness. Do you have what it takes to be the King of Naughtiness? Find out this summer.